Engineering Failures, with Stephen the Engineer. Imagine you're a gust of wind, whooshing through the Tacoma Narrows in Washington State one brisk morning in 1940. Suddenly, you encounter a colossal steel and concrete structure that is not supposed to be dancing. But it is. The Tacoma Narrows Bridge, an engineering marvel, is jiving to your tune. It's not every day you see a suspension bridge perform a captivating ribbon dance. And then it happens. The dance ends with a heartbreaking finale. A collapse. Oh, the chilling tale of the Tacoma Narrows Bridge, a story that redefined engineering for generations to come. Dubbed, Galloping Journey, the Tacoma Narrows Bridge was an architectural spectacle, praised far and wide for its slender grace and aesthetic appeal. But beauty can sometimes be a beast in disguise, and this bridge was no exception. The tale of its construction and eventual self-destruction makes for one of the most dramatic stories in the annals of engineering. Now, let's backtrack a bit. The design of the Tacoma Narrows Bridge was quite innovative for its time. With a central span measuring 2,800 feet, the third longest in the world then. It was a sight to behold. Engineers tried to cut costs by making the girders unusually shallow. At only 8 feet deep, they were a quarter of the depth of other similar bridges. A choice that would prove, well, problematic. Once operational, the bridge exhibited peculiar behaviors. It undulated in moderate winds, earning its nickname, Galloping Journey. The engineers noticed this strange dance but initially dismissed it as a fascinating, yet harmless spectacle. After all, the bridge was designed to sway, right? Just not gallop. They even installed hydraulic buffers and tie-down cables, hoping to tame the wild stallion, so to speak. But Jerdy had a mind of her own. November 7, 1940. A day that would go down in the engineering history books. Winds clocked at a modest 42 miles per hour, nothing the bridge hadn't experienced before. But on this day, Jerdy decided to show off some new moves. Twisting, rather than swaying, the entire central span was caught in a violent torsional ripple. It looked like a roller coaster track, an outlandish sight that drew an excited crowd. It was around 11 a.m. when Jerdy decided she was done dancing. With a roar heard across the water, the bridge collapsed. The only fatality? A cocker spaniel abandoned in a car. A heartbreaking loss, but a miracle considering what could have happened. What went wrong? Post-collapse analysis pointed the finger at aeroelastic flutter, a phenomenon where aerodynamic forces align with a structure's natural mode of vibration. To put it simply, the wind got Jerdy dancing until she could dance no more. This incident shook the engineering world and spurred changes in bridge design. Today, the remains of the original Tacoma Narrows Bridge rest at the bottom of the Puget Sound, serving as an artificial reef. A replacement bridge, appropriately respectful of the lessons learned, stands tall in its place. The story of the Tacoma Narrows Bridge is a stark reminder that while engineering can create wonders, a single oversight can lead to catastrophic failures. So, the next time you cross a bridge, maybe spare a thought for the intricate engineering at work that keeps you safe.